my ladies, come closer. Do you know that engagement ring is a trap? Why do they look me? I see a lot of you. Once a man engages you, you'll be shouting, oh, oh. Some of you have become so dramatic, epileptic, once they give you engagement ring. Engagement ring is a trap. Once a man gives you engagement ring, it simply means that he wants to marry you. When a man gives you an engagement ring, at least in the next two to three months, he's getting married to you. It's not the one that will give you engagement ring and keep you for five years. That is not engagement. That is bondage. Engagement simply means I am prepared to take it to the next level. Remember, when they give you engagement ring is one. When they marry you, they double it. Hmm? Stop letting this man engage you for too long. They are trapping you. A lot of men just want to trap you so that other men will not have you. They are not giving you engagement ring because they love you. It's a trap. They just want you to feel trapped. You need to be wise enough. If a man is not ready to marry you, it's okay to wait. Don't collect the engagement ring. And start feeling like, oh, I'm a wife. Mm -mm. Once he gives you the engagement ring, it simply means he has the financial capacity to back up that ring. Stop being the lord of the ring. Stop being too desperate. Now, the problem is, I don't know the notion or the relationship therapies that a lot of you are talking to. I don't know the mindset most of you have about marriage. I don't know what you actually think is happening in marriage. But let me tell you, marriage is so much work that when I see young people doing, <laughs> I'll be smiling because a lot of you are just excited for nothing. Marriage is so much work. It's more than just that engagement ring that is in your hand. Marriage is commitment. Marriage is effort. Marriage is work. Marriage is sweat. Marriage is stress. Because I see a lot of you so excited about collecting an engagement ring to pepper us on Instagram. Yet, you don't know what it takes to be married. A time is coming when that engagement ring will begin to pepper your hand. So wear them safe, it could be paying you for hand. So you need to wise up. Understand what it takes to be married first before you start to do, ah, ah, they give you ring, you are crying. <laughs> what, what, what's the meaning of all that drama? You know, the one that annoys me the most is that you are dating a guy and he engaged you and you are acting surprised. So all the while you were with him, you never knew he was going to marry. So what's all the drama for? Take the ring and be sure that you're ready to spend the rest of your life with him. Stop all this, pepper them on Instagram, pepper them on Facebook, pepper them on Twitter. We don't care. Everybody just wants to use you as a news. You need to be sure that you are ready to be married to that person. Stop all this, pepper them, but land let you will end up peppering yourself. So please, I'm actually appealing to all the young, beautiful girls out there. I know that the society is putting on so much pressure on all of you to get married. Marry, marry, marry. Even me as a relationship therapist, they are even putting pressure on me. But because I understand what it takes to be married, I'm taking my time. I'm not allowing anybody pressure on me or say anything or put any pressure on me. Take your time. Engagement ring doesn't mean anything. Marriage is even more in the heart. Engagement ring is even just a costume. Yes, it doesn't mean anything. The real marriage is a made up mind, is a prepared mind. It's understanding that you're going there to walk. You're going there to plant so that you can pluck. Because in marriage, if you don't plant, you cannot pluck. That's the honest truth. So to all the young girls out there that a lot of men are using an engagement ring to trap, I see a lot of young girls in their 21, 22, 23, small boys engaging them and you are shouting, your boyfriend is engaging you, there is no way he can feed you and the children. No, you need to plan your future. As a young person, you need to start having what is called valid conversation in your relationship and marriage. Stop shying away from valid conversation. I find it very weird that you can open your legs for a man and have sex every day shamelessly. Like, as a young girl, you are so shameless about removing your bra, removing your pants. But when you want to have valid conversations that connect your future and your life, you're saying, I'm shy. I don't want to look desperate. I don't want to look somehow. The fact that you've taken off your pants, you're already desperate. The fact that you've taken off your pants, you're already cheap. Have this valid conversation so that you can know where you are headed to. Because when you don't have valid conversation, you live based on assumption. 
and it's assumption that has sent a lot of people to their doom you are assuming you're in a relationship with this person define it let this person tell you i want to date you i want to marry you let's see how this thing go you now know how to plan yourself don't sit down and be assuming because the both of you are wearing the same clothes because you used to go to his house and cook for him because don't don't always have, be grown enough to have what is called valid conversations if you can have sex you can have this conversation if you can have sex there's absolutely nothing to be shy about you can have you can actually ask a man where is this relationship leading to am i the kind of woman you want to spend the rest of your life with? let me know where i'm going to so that i don't waste my time and i don't waste my energy because most time before you put in your energy somewhere you need to know that it is futuristic it is something that can yield interest before you invest somewhere you know that it is long term don't invest your money your energy your anything where you know that it's not going to take you anywhere so that's the reason why i say define it before you go and start giving a man your body your heart and your soul be sure that it is defined let it be that he lied to you let it be that he deceived you but define whatever you are doing with anybody it gives you clarity and clarification to your destination i love you guys have a wonderful day